Hey, folks. Johnny Valentine here. Just crawling back up under my house one more time. Oh, no, seriously, though, I, I just can't wait until... Okay, in case you're seeing that water by the water heater, that's where I drained the water heater yesterday while I changed the plumbing out. I'm redoing a lot of the plumbing in here with Pat. Plumbing in this house is... It ain't leaking, but it leaves something to be desired. So, if you have jobs you really hate to do, you should try, uh, try putting some YouTube on there. YouTube actually makes you feel, you got your YouTube going, you actually feel like somebody's there with you suffering. It's not as bad because you lie to yourself and tell yourself that people are going to watch. I've got a song that I wrote about crawl spaces. Back when I was doing my solar hot water, we, we, we were working crawl spaces a lot. And I had this song that I came up with. I'll sing you a little bit of it. I know it's early in the morning, but you like Whoa, darling, you don't know about the crawl spaces and the tight places I've been. You ain't seen the underneath the houses I've been working in. And honey, if I come home and I'm a little bit snappy, don't you wonder why I'm acting so mean? Well, baby. You don't know about the crawl spaces and the hard times I've seen. Boom, boom, boom. You may be warm in the winter and cool in the summertime. But somebody had to go up under your house just so you could feel so fine. So, baby. When you're sitting in your easy chair, won't you please remember me? Cause you don't know about the crawl spaces and the hard times I've seen. Then I usually do a little bit well. Yesterday, I was just in a deep, dark crawl space, and I was cutting up a stump, pulling roots, when all of a sudden, found a big old stump and I had to cut it out and I had to dig it out. It was nasty. Oh, oh man. So anyway, now the stump's out. Got my stump out of there. Which is a good move. Now my spray foam dies and they got to lay down that vapor barrier. It's going to be real easy for them to lay that vapor barrier down instead of having another the penetration so how future homeowner of this place if you watch this video you'll know that we cared i got up under there and did that for you okay i'm gonna drag this thing out now be careful <sighs> you don't know about the crawl spaces in the Hard times I've seen. No, darling. You don't know about the quiet spaces and the hard times that I've seen. Oh, you may be warm in the winter. Pero es de trabajar bajo de una casa. Pero esa casa, esa crawl space no es muy fea. No, no. no son, hay, hay muchas más feas, ¿verdad? ¿eh? Sí. No, es esta. Lo que nos hace difícil este es que tiene muchas columnas. Ajá, pa, hay que sellar sí. por muchas, ¿ah? ¿eh? Pero lo demás no. Pero está. Buena, buen espacio, buena altura. Buena altura, buen espacio. Ajá. ¿Quiere esa luz? También no, 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 no. puedo dejarlo porque vengo, yo, yo voy a venir más tarde.
Bueno, si quieres, tal vez la ocupemos ahorita Mira, para ponerle... mira, te voy a dejar esto y dos pilas, dos baterías. Okay. Aquí es el botón, ahí abajo. Aquí. ¿Dónde okay. la pongo? Aquí, Cuando déjalo. Termine. Yo no, yo no, yo voy a llegar antes de que termine. Déjalo ahí, así. Colgalo si quieres. Pero no te lo colgues de una pipa. Sino colgalo ahí. Para que tiene bastante luz para poner bien la barrera de vapor. This is that vapor barrier these guys are putting down. ¿Por qué tiene que poner el, el negro? I, I... ¿Cuál? Esos pedacitos. Oh, no, estos pedacitos. Oh, ok. Yeah. This stuff is awesome. Va a salir bien esto. Mucho mejor. Van a poner que poner un poco más ahí. Porque no. no? Esta se ha bajado, nomás lo levantamos cuando. Ah, ok. Ahí, como ese. Ok. Hay que se ha doblado hacia abajo. Ah, ok. Nada más a las vallas. Ah, ok, ya. Yeah. Ok, amigo. Oh, man. So, this crawl space is going to be so much nicer. Yeah, voy a dejar la batería. Alright. Woo, man. I gotta go on a site visit now. I want to show you this stuff real quick. So this is what I'm having them put in here. So if you're in the southeast and you got a nasty crawl space, this may be something you want. I guess I can take my mask off now. This is that stuff I was just talking about. It's a you can't mm, see it. It's, it's not like black mill plastic. You see these. This is a 12 mil reinforced poly, so it's got a fabric in it. It's actually got, I don't know if you can see it, but there's actually poly, and then it's got kind of a cordage, almost like the, a dental floss woven into it. So it's, it's extra strong, so when your trades are going up under there, you're not going to rip your vapor barrier. This is not that much more in a new construction um, than that black plastic, but it's just going to last way longer. It's your crawl space, so if you need your crawl space encapsulated because it's just a constant problem, not only is it going to make it nicer to work under there when I do this, it's going to it's going to kill my energy bills because instead of having just insulation in the subfloor right there, I'm going to have insulation all the way to here, and this whole area is going to become conditioned basically, and so I'm not going to have that what they call the stack effect where the cold air and the hot air are just like thermosiphoning up through the house. I'm going to stop the stack effect. The house is no longer going to feel really cold on the exterior, on the edges. Believe me, folks, I know what I'm talking about here because I had my crawl space uh, encapsulated and made a lot of difference, especially in the winter. Plus, going up under there is not so daunting anymore. But anyway, there they are laying out the fabric. Super happy. I'll show you the foam later on. The guys finished up and uh, they left me a Tyvek suit. It's going to be good use. But I want to take you inside. So, uh, the foam smells. This is Isonine open cell. kind of smells when it first uh, gets sprayed, but that'll go away in a couple of days. So, a little dirt. They left a little dirt on the floor because they're coming in and out, but we'll vacuum that up later. And, uh, totally different place so it's quieter it just changes everything when you do one of these so anyway take you to the familiar spots we were in it is not the same crawl space so there's where I chop that stump out very nice I'd much rather be up under this house now They did a pretty good job. This is where we were hanging out. They were complaining about the spiders. They didn't like the spiders. But it's just a totally different place I'm putting here now. It's the kind of place where you'd really want to make a life for yourself. Could live here for many years. And uh, yeah, so it goes all the way to the band. So you don't have that cold spot of the floor right at the edge of the house. 
this is, in my, in my opinion, far, far superior to an open crawl space with bad insulation in the roof or in the floor. This is awesome. So the company that did this for me is Southern Foam and Coating out of Gainesville, Georgia. And I'm another. I'm a happy customer many times over with these people. Thanks for watching.